So, the best way header trailer by Solar Guy Modding is not working as intended, uh, especially not today, at time of recording. This is uh, what 2nd of April 2024, but I think it's a good starting point. It's incredible, incredibly detailed, and the functionality of this is really great. The, even the handles go back and forward, but... Yeah, I cannot get it to, to work as a header trailer, even <laughs> even if it's, it's actually a header trailer. I tried it with corn headers, I tried it with, you know, ordinary grain um, headers. All of these headers I've tried is in-game ones, small ones, big ones. Uh, I've tried it just driving past it, um, backwards. Uh, there are two different types of this one. It's... Um, one, uh, let's just jump into here, and it's on the header trailers. So the two different version is a manual control and a simple control. I think the manual control one, the only difference on that one is that uh, then you can drive this uh, little machinery here manually. Uh, you can unfold it to get it all the way down here, but then you can also manually drive it up and down. Uh, I, I had some fun, me and <laughs> Mrs. McGee here, <laughs> we tried to hook it on to 3-point cedars, I also tried it with a 3-point, three <laughs> three uh, well, this was a cultivator, and I hope, you, uh, you know, my best hope was it, it would just flip it up to the air, uh, didn't work. Um, I tried it with a power arrow, worked pretty nice. And I thought maybe, you know, you can simulate that you're having a um, um, truck on the front there, and then your tractor, and then you implement. Look at the details. It's nice. But <laughs> I couldn't even get up here with my tractor. Uh, if you choose to have it with a floor decking, you can also have these ramps. Uh, but there's also, <laughs> I got really stuck here, um, there's obviously uh, some collision uh, thing here, um, so yeah, uh, but that's probably also going to be fixed in the update. The thing which this one is perfect for, and which I have been searching for and waiting for, for many months now, is the big plow. This is a perfect match, as they say in Ireland. This is the, uh, I think this, I pulled out the biggest one, the SM82, yeah. A 26 or 27 meter plow. I've always struggled to transport this one here, but with this little fellow here, it's a perfect match. Look at this now. And I, I'm going to try something afterwards, um, which I haven't tested out yet, but uh, yeah, this solves a lot of problems with this one, doing big plow jobs or just, you know, you know, plowing your own fields. Look on the width it takes now. So this is the, this is the perfect plow trailer. It's not the header trailer, it's a plow trailer. So the thing I wanted to test now is, let's see, let's unfold it again. Uh, maybe we can have it connected. <laughs> and do some plowing. Uh, let's see, let's move to the plow now. And be aware, I haven't tested this, so I don't know if it's, uh, you know, if it's low enough to to do some plowing, but maybe we can just have it connected to this one. And, you know, the, the turning radius is not great with this one, uh, but a simple solution to that one on all these kind of connections is to have the drawbar, to have this one uh, in between. That increases a lot when it comes to the, the turning rate, because the drawbar connects to these little fellows there. So, let's see. I need, I need my help window now. <laughs> let's see. Uh, why can't fold plow allow create fields, maybe? No, I, I cannot. I 
I cannot uh, lower the plow. Oh man, that's a shame. Let's see. Can I lower this more? Eh. I'm missing 10 centimeters. No. Maybe there's somebody who's gonna figure this out. Uh, you know, with, um, with with some kind of implement in between her, maybe some of the cheeky, um, you know, we have those weights, those three-point weights, uh, these guys here, maybe these in between or something like that, or maybe this one. But yeah, I'm missing. 10 centimeter here and I could just have it connected but anyway it's um let's see if we can fold it now now I'm folding the trailer and it's actually folding the uh, no let's see fold cutter trailer oh there we go let's see if we can <laughs> <laughs> Unfold the plow now. Unfold plow. Oh, yeah, we can. See, if you want, you can. <laughs> you can drive it like this, but uh, yeah, so it's a perfect plow trailer. Currently. But it's gonna be probably a great header trailer also. Up, 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 up. I made it, I made it, I made it, I, I found the solution, you can do some plowing with this connected to the trailer, I'm gonna show you which kind of, <laughs> which kind of uh, uh, weights you're gonna need, it's those two I showed you guys, let's see here now, um, so the two uh, weights I have connected now are these two guys here, um, I think maybe I have the pictures installed, but anyway, this is the um, these two guys here, the Lizard 500 and 900. It's a pack called Weight Pack. Uh, these two, I'm um, sorry, these two are part of a pack called Weight Pack 650 900. So you're gonna need this one, the square one, and you're gonna need this one, the Lizard Weight um, with hooks on it. So what you do is to connect these two together, simple as that, and now you should be able <laughs> to do some plowing. <laughs> Let's see, I'm on the plow now, let's unfold this bad boy, and with these two weights there, um, you should also be able to do some fast farming. Let's see here now. Uh, allow create fields. Uh, and now I also get the option of lower plow. Oh yeah. <laughs> Look at this. So you're plowing in what? 26, 27 kilometers an hour. And you have the header. Well, plow trailer with you. So it's uh, now let's. Uh, we can just, you know, you finish plowing. Um, you can hook this one up and go back to the plow and fold the plow and yeah this is perfect solo guy modding you made a perfect plow trailer <laughs> thanks for watching and bye bye